ready to chow down like Galactus. Because we're going to eat the universe. On Flip. The Big Bubble Show! I'm Lorraine. I'm Ryan. And if you're like us, you probably already had your fill of Thanksgiving goodies this weekend. But what do you do with the leftovers? Me, I like to craft them into little food mustaches and then just <laughs> eat them Wait, off my face. Is a moustache made of moose? I don't know, okay. Well, if you guys turn that into food mustaches, we've got you covered because we have here to compete for ultimate Thanksgiving leftover domination with Marvel-themed meals are our superhero-like chefs, Emily Chapman and Rich Parente. Yes, and we're gonna guess who or what in the Marvel Universe their dishes are based upon. Yeah, let's eat the universe. All right. Welcome professional chef and Shop Impossible champion, Emily Chapman. As well as owner and chef of Pot Hello Grill in Brewster, New York. Rich Parente. Uh, hi guys. Hey. How's it going? We make everybody sit in the back seat like we're in a car. <laughs> uh, we have our first course from Emily. Mm. All mm. right. What is this? It looks amazing. Yeah, what are we looking at here? Okay guys, so this is a leftover New York turkey sandwich is what I like to call it. Mm. So it's turkey pastrami, uh, Brussels kraut, mashed cauliflower. Wait, Brussels kraut? Brussels kraut. That's dope. Uh, mashed cauliflower and a little bit of chili paste onto a black cranberry bun. Mm. So mm. it's real good. So this time I just really wanted to get inspired from my childhood favorite hero, mm -hmm. and I really love sandwiches on Thanksgiving, and I thought that this was a really easy way to make at home, and a really fun way to represent my favorite character. So this is based on a character. Um, I need a hint. Okay, so the first major hint is that it's a New York turkey sandwich. So that's the one thing that I really tried to emphasize on being the pastrami. Is this near Westchester, New York? Uh, no, this would probably be more in the, uh, the Manhattan area. Like a... Thing? No. So... Th one of the other clues that I wanted to put in is the mashed cauliflower. And the mashed cauliflower represents somebody who's very close to this character. Um, cauliflower could also be reference to cauliflower ear, which you get from boxing. Matt Murdock, oh, Daredevil. No. Yes, yeah. this is a Daredevil sandwich. So this spicy is for Hell's Kitchen, uh, the New York uh, pastrami and Brussels kraut, just to emphasize the, our amazing city. Um, and then the black cranberry bun to represent the hand because he's always squished in between the hand. I love it. <laughs> I love it. That is awesome. But we also have another no dish. No, no. <laughs> well, you can have the rest later. Mm -hmm. All right. So our next course is by Rich. Let's take a look. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. Okay. I see there's something that's... Wiggly bits. It's got <laughs> wiggly bits. There are officially some wiggly bits. Can you tell? No. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Can you tell us what these wiggly bits are? Well, when Emily called me, she said we have to do leftovers mm -hmm. to represent a childhood uh, hero mm -hmm. who might still be my hero. Um, <laughs> so I use the leftovers. I use the stuffing as the bread mm -hmm. and the uh, turkey and some of our house-made pickles because that person likes extra pickles. And then uh, apparently mm. they also like gummy worms, so I made some uh, cranberry gummy worms. <laughs> Extra pickles, flattened. Hmm. Gummy worms. Give me some more info. Give me some more. Uh, what are these worms made of? Side note. They're uh, gelatin. Mm. And and uh, cranberry sauce. Okay. Do you have like a worm maker? Uh, <laughs> yeah, straw. <laughs> cool. DIY. <laughs> nope. Um, so, give us some hints. Well, I made a grilled cheese because the person's pretty young, and I figured all young guys like uh, grilled cheese. And uh, gummy worms, because what high school kid doesn't like gummy worms? Ooh. Would this be someone who is bug related? Possibly. Maybe spider bugs that aren't bugs but are arachnids? Yes. <laughs> spider Man! <laughs> you doubt it. Mm. Mm. And that was from the scene from Homecoming, you were saying. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. He, in the bodega, he orders a number five with extra pickles and gets two packages of gummy worms. So this is more like a Spider Man coming home for Thanksgiving. There you uh, go. Uh, <laughs> Perfect. Yep. Man, you mm. guys are really clever. I like. 
the cool little touches and the, the details, it's wild. There's oh. probably so much food in my mustache right now. It's great. It's Can actually it? looking okay. You can see it later. <laughs> All right. Well, both dishes are totally incredible, yep. but which one do you think fits the sort of theme of superhero nostalgia? Ooh. We, we said we would choose a winner, which is... I can't. Why? Dang near impossible. Uh, I love the touches going back to Matt's dad and, and like, the, the Murdoch stuff for Daredevil and, like, those things. But then, like, the finer th touches like, that we have with the Wormies. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I love these worms. They're both super delicious. See, I really like the thing about the hands squishing oh, down on yeah. Daredevil. That, like, really speaks to me. <laughs> But then I also like the detail of the five with extra pickles from Spider-Man Homecoming. To be fair, this was your idea to have it a competition. <laughs> <laughs> we just wanted to say you guys are great. Yeah. <laughs> this is real tough. Um, okay, we have to confer. <laughs> I agree. Okay. So, okay, we've come to a decision. Yes. It is definitely Emily. Uh, I was gonna say a tie because I was gonna go with Rick. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it's actually a tie. Um, <laughs> thank you both, Emily and Rich, for creating these amazing Marvel dishes. And check out where you can see their awesome food down in the description. Yeah, and now it's time for social hour because I'm gonna eat the hell out of this. <laughs> Now it's time for social hour, where we take your tweets and your Yotub comments when you hashtag Marvel Whip. But you know, honestly, I could really go for something sweet, like a, like a pizza. <laughs> Those aren't sweet. But you know what? We do have a comment from our own James Arthur, who says, I have dessert. Hope you guys saved some room. Oh, oh, James. Yeah, those are my special Thanksgiving Marvel marble. See what I did there? <laughs> Captain America brownies. And they represent all iterations of Captain America. Sam and Wilson, Steve Rogers, and even Miss America Chavez. And they also defy gravity because they are not moving at all. What is? <laughs> what did you put in just, these, James? Just eat it. Love. Lots of love. Yeah? Shall we? Oh, love. Oh. Whoa. 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 Brian almost put some not love in yeah. those. I, I work all day and night. Yeah, let's, I'm going to watch these oh my reactions. God. Just get in there. Yeah. <laughs> get it in that mustache. Mm. Oh my yeah. God, it tastes like America. Mm. Yeah. Mm. America. Right, now, what are you grateful for right now? I'm thankful that you showed up with dessert. Yeah. And, and pizza. then I got to eat food at work. <laughs> Best thing ever. Oh. I actually haven't even had one myself. No, you can have one. All right, fine. Here's okay, one. yeah, it's it's sharing. It's when Thanksgiving is a part of sharing. Yeah. Sure. Oh. I love that. Mm -hmm. oh. But you guys should tell us which course was your favorite and which one would you most want to eat? Uh, Emily's sandwich, Rich's sandwich, or one of these Captain, Captain America, America brownies. brownies? Yeah. Mm. That's great. Good mm. job, James. Thank mm. you. Oh, did I win Thanksgiving? No. Mm. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just checking. I thought I would ask. Mm. Oh, but also, if you guys happen to like this super, totally awesome Star Lord and Groot fine art statue, it was provided by our sponsor, Kotobukiya. And hey, guess what? Y'all have the chance to win this very statue when you head over to the Whip the Big Marvel Show Facebook page and leave a comment on this video. For more information and full official real rules, check out the link below. I'm sorry, I'm just really invested in eating this brownie. <laughs> and don't good? forget no. to follow our Facebook page for even more cool stuff. I'm gonna put all the rest of the brownies in the box for them. Oh yeah. I don't know if those are gonna keep because yeah. this this contest only happens for a little bit of time, but you'll have to check out the full information down below. Um, mm. You guys, I'm so thankful for you. Aww. Yeah, we're thankful for you guys too. Yeah. For watching. Yeah. I'm Lorraine. I'm Ryan. And I'm James. And this is Marvel. Your universe. Yeah. Hey guys, if you like this, please like this and watch, subscribe. What are you doing? I'm giving, I'm giving yeah. him some brownie. Well, Everybody you, gets to eat. Subscribe mm. to the Marvel channel. Or watch the last episode right over there. Mm. Or feed your Star Lord statue brownies. If it has a little bit of chocolate on it, it's authentic. No, it's <laughs> sent with love. <laughs>